por fé. O meu binário um, this insurance and their and their products in connection with uh, risk management. Insured. 
But the, camp, the contract which says the company that is, is responsible is what is called um, is the insurer. Now, let's look at the difference or the distinction between insurance and bonding. Then we look at what is bonding. Let's look at this insurance and bonding. Let's look at that difference between insurance and bonding. Remember, we are saying it's to do with the, this one we are looking at here, to do with the risk. But this risk, what we are looking at is that you cannot only learn about risk. You have to know that in this, out of this risk, the insurance again has to come into, into it. That's why we are looking at, let's look at the, let's look at, Insurance and bonding. What is a bond? What is insurance? Is there any difference between a bonding, bonding and insurance? So let's look at the distinction between insurance and bonding. Distinction between insurance. And body. Distinction is insurance and Oh, 
vitu vitumbusani hadi aneje ngo vitu na ugano wa dikki ya rabe de bisidi is more or less like a lawyer right bisidi a lawyer is in fact as the should be body right he stands between two bodies right ama kidenga na kale yuko lao mama ya kidenga kama sasa so it's more or less like that as body a should be body and like the short body because the short body is between you and the other to be you already you are given the instructions you read the instructions given them you say you enter the contract but with this three people are involved ora ba ora kiridwa dio ka so i'm looking at the dai the body you know just if i was this is really a trick for me the dai the body it is different from what is called uh one type of should the bond bond the should the bond in bond is the right bond so if the right bond is it is it is uh, it protects an employer against this honest act by his or her employees it will just protect the employer it just go be against this honest act by his or her employees so who is by his or her uh, employees so it's just it's going to just protect it will protect the employer right from employees according to his or her act, act. so that's what it's called he died in bond it's more or less like it's a bond that says that Uh, that there might be other um, other issues where uh, uh, this guy he seems to be so dishonest. Right? For example, maybe unfair treatment in China, right? Dishonest. He's not even following uh, the contract. He's not even following the contract, right? So there must be a go between and like an agent. Who can back everything? Who can back the man? And who can be if who can be in, uh, in between employers and employees? That's why I was just looking at this as uh, lawyers. Lawyers will stand in between um, one person and the and the other part. So uh, that is what is called fidelity bond. It's a bond. It's a surety bond. Was some sometimes lawyers we are from we have no problem we have no lawyers can stand here and can say the plan is part of it and the other tab the mail the bylaws the bylaws the bylaws free one tab and the so that is just for the day they want but you know about this issue they they they, they that they uh that they should be born. Surely the body, it must be, it's more or less like a very good example of the surely body, it's a lawyer. So within a lawyer, there is a, uh, there is a principal, so there must be a principal, there must be an obligee who is in, in between and can be an insured, and we can be someone who is insured. In other words, uh, if you look at it, So it should be the body here, it should be the body, it should be the body. It's something like the, the insured, because of all of you, right? The obligee can be, um, uh, it should, sometimes the insurance company itself, you can, you can you go and you can go get, uh, you can buy, you can buy, um, you can buy one of their products. And buy like or you can buy an insurance, you can buy insurance, right? For 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 insurance, and insurance is it's a protecting. Now if you don't put a lot, don't put a lot. So someone else will encourage you to put a lot of insurance. Okay, they are not insurance insurance company. You know, product is the good amount. So if it's the insurance company. That you that you that you pay. It's just a company that you pay the dogs. 
But now if you watch this few of this one, uh, these securities, the surety bonding. Surety bonding a very good, good, good example of this surety bonding. Surety bonding. Or sometimes go to see if he does the body. He does the body. Where someone, I'm a right? Who you? I'm with me, the other one. I can do all my life after my time. As I'm with me, I'm with me. To the extent that someone can kill a person, but if I, he's thinking that he's dead. That is not. Right? So, that's why they are under the uh, surety board. The principal who pays the board and pays the pressure, but the obligee receives the protection. So who receives, who receives the protection? So it is the principal that obtains the board and pays the pressure, but the obligee receives the protection. So if you want this statement, the second one, the obligee is the one who receives, who receives the protection. We are looking at now. Uh, that you have bought an insurance company. I mean, you have bought a, 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 a insurance, insurance map and mode. So it means that you are, you are, you are, you are here, you are receiving that protection. You are not the issue, right? So you have got the principal and you have got the insurer. So that has been the insurer. So, sure. so the one, this one is the one that is receiving the protection. According to, and that under the security bond, the principal can just obtain the bond. You just have to buy the bond and pay the payment. But the obligee is one that you the protection. And you work in insured, insured insurance, you just purchase the insurance contract and you protect yourself or myself. You go to the insurance, you just go and protect yourself or myself. I can again look at this issue here where you are looking at it. You have killed a person, the insurance is the one that you will pay. And you will, you will, you will not ask anything, but someone will do it on your behalf. That's why I say that they are taking people in court. But a lot under the security bond, they be caused intentionally by the police. An insurance that, uh, an insurance cost should be uh, accidental from the viewpoint of police. So this one is an accidental, but this one. You can create it so someone can create it, and the other one is just being an uh, I think you can, you can you know when you go, I just go, what is the, this security bond in the country? You can move that from there, right? Yeah, you can stop it there. You can stop it there.
Thank you. 